Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to CB12 reviews in this video, limited time only. Tim Hortons, Retro Donuts, hashtag food review, hashtag Tim Hortons. This is the new one that he uploaded yesterday, and I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize, and I will take care of them. Now, let's get to this video. Hey, everyone. Troy Cole here, and welcome back to another food review. Today, we are checking out Tim Horton's Retro Donuts. So, we got the Dutchie, the Blueberry Fritter, and the Walnut. Crunch. I also have a cinnamon twist, which they didn't have, so the next time I go to Tim Hortons, I'll definitely review it. Normally, I would have said, let's open this up and check it out, but the box is already open. <laughs> so let's try the Walnut Crunch. I already know this is going to be really good. So here it is. Look at the Walnut. Oh my. Yes. The Sweet Glaze. Walnut Crunch, fantastic. I think we're going to rate them after we try them all. This okay. is the Dutchie, and I, which I think I have reviewed this one already. Super soft yeast donut. Raisins kind of add that nice little tartness to it. The sweet glaze, super soft donut. My ultimate favorite one, the Blue Bear Fair. Cheers. This reminds me so much like the blueberry donut they had. That kind of reminds me of that sour cream glaze, but it was a blueberry donut. That the flavor is spawn on the same thing. So after trying them all, I would say Blueberry Fritter would be number one. Walnut Crunch would be number two. Then the Dutchie over rating, I would give the Blueberry Fritter all day, five out of five, from me to you all day. Wow. The sweet blueberry, the flavor of that blueberry is fantastic. Like I said, reminds me of that blueberry donut. Super sweet glaze, the soft fritter itself. The blueberry filling wasn't overly sweet, but it just kind of evened out the sweetness of that glaze. Fantastic. The walnut crunch was really good. Super soft, cakey donut. The walnuts just added that nice little crunch. The super sweet glaze on top. Everything was great. It's an overly sweet donut. The Dutchie was still one of my top three favorite donuts. The sweet glaze, the super soft donut. It kind of reminded me of an apple fur, but with raisins. The raisins kind of even out the sweetness of the glaze. The tartness of those raisins. Really good. Would give the Walnut Crunch a four and a half out of five, and I would give the Dutchie a four out of five. From me to you wow. all day. A must wow. try. Try them all, wow. and then determine which one you guys like. My question, you guys, have you guys tried any of the retro donuts? If you guys have, let me know in the comment section below on which one is your favorite. And let's talk. Hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you guys did, sure, work with the seal thumbs up and subscribe. Definitely ring that bell notification so that way you never miss a review. Please consider following me on Instagram. That's where I'll let you guys know what's coming up next. I do want to thank you guys very much for watching. Definitely. Sorry for mumbling to myself. Sorry about that, everybody. Share this review with your friends and family, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace out. Awesome video. I give it a thumbs up, and I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my channel or to CB12 Reviews channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know when we both post and share both of our videos with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. And on my channel, we are on the road to 9,000 subscribers. And please help me bring my views and watch hours up on my channel by taking a look at my other videos that are on the two playlists that are on my channel. And give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate it. And please help me bring my subscriber count up on my channel as well. Also, please, everybody, I would really definitely appreciate that too. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya.